Well, I was told that there was a huge demand for urban logistics space and decided that I would like to try and find a way to quantify that urgent need for space. Well, I built the model around a vague idea of how Amazon approaches their real estate needs and uh, really looked into how to build that in a step-by-step -step model. I drew the data from various sources. I had to start around uh, a ratio between a uh, number of vans servicing a facility that translates into required square meters for a urban logistics facility. Uh, various inputs included uh, macroeconomic data, uh, also uh, parcel volumes, uh, weightings on looking at how occupiers use space and how deliveries are made. There's a number of different strategies that we integrated into this model. Okay, the two takeaways from the urban space model are first that uh, demonstrating the, exactly how much need there is for urban logistics space in major markets in Europe. And the second takeaway has to do with uh, just understanding uh, through the steps in the model uh, the different strategies for delivering goods um, and doing this last uh, link in the supply chain. I think that there would be a next step to this uh, model, which is to now try and quantify how much existing urban logistics space is in these major markets and use the model's calculations as a benchmark so that we can see how much space we actually need to build uh, it's not an easy product to build, but um, I think that there are solutions out there and uh, future solutions to come.